So I did pick up a couple of things from the Nordstrom anniversary sale. <laughs> yeah, I only ended up picking up two handbags and then I have an order of candles on the way. No beauty exclusives, but today I'm gonna show you what I picked up. It's mostly a handbag video. And then I did go in store to Nordstrom to take a look at everything and I compiled a list. As somebody who shopped the Nordstrom anniversary sale for years of what I like the most, what I think is worth it. So I will have those items links down below. I'll go over them towards the end but first let's go over what I personally bought at the anniversary sale yeah you know this year for beauty exclusives I didn't think it was all that if I'm being honest so I actually passed on all of the beauty exclusives and I went straight to the handbags I thought that the coach items were a very very good deal so the first item that I picked up was the color block leather crossbody so both of these are from Coach. If you've watched my purse collection video, you would know I wanted to grow my Coach handbag collection. And I thought the ones that they had on the Nordstrom anniversary sale were really, really cute. So this one actually did not even catch my eye until I saw it in person. They also have these available in black and red. So I will have those linked down below, but I was super attracted to the color block. So I picked this up for $99. I think that's a really good deal for a coach retail item. So here's what it looks like. You can see that it is a pebbled leather and what always catches my eye with coach bags is that they have a removable strap that's really important to me because I am very petite so a lot of times I don't like the straps that they come with. And then it also has a divided interior to keep everything organized. So the length on this is seven inches, four inches in height and there's not a ton of depth. It's just an inch and a quarter. But let's take a look because I I thought that this was so much cuter in person. So we have the twist lock here. So you can see it's gold hardware and then you open it up. And then here are what the leather compartments are gonna look like. Let me get all of the paper and stuff out. I haven't really opened or looked through these since I purchased these, so I'm excited. So there are three dividers here. So there's a zip in the center, which is really good to keep the valuable stuff. And then if you want to throw stuff in the sides, you have these here. And you'll see in this compartment, you have two card slots. So I have the biggest iPhone. So let's see if it fits. So I'm sticking it in the middle compartment with the zipper and it slides in perfectly. And then you still have room if you want to put your cards out here. So this is just a essentials only kind of situation. You're not gonna be able to be a pack rat and have a bunch of stuff in here. But I mean, if you look at the size, you'll know it's not going to be for that. I'm a person who does not carry a lot of stuff with me, so I like really small bags. So the phone does not fit in the outer pockets, only the main pocket. And then of course on the sides, you have the strap. So I'm gonna show you how the bag looks on me. So as you guys know, I am only 4'10 and I'm very petite and the strap that it comes with, it's a wee bit longer than I prefer, but I'm not bothered by it. I still think it's usable. What I plan on doing is I think it's going to look really cute with a shoulder strap. This is a makeshift example, but this is why I look for bags that have removable straps because I'm totally going to wear it as just a shoulder bag. I think that's really cute. So. I think that this is overall a really good deal from Coach and it is so cute. Obviously, it's a very small bag. It doesn't hold a lot. But again, with the removable strap, of course, for me, there's customizations. I think it's going to look totally cute as a shoulder bag. It's also cute as a simple crossbody. If you love small crossbody bags, this one feels very well made. It's not too heavy. If you're traveling, this is going to fit in your suitcase or you can squeeze it into bigger bag. So I'm really excited about this. I'm excited about having a new addition to my coach collection. And for $99, this is such a good deal for coach. You guys know coach prices for retail normally run around $200 
So I'm really happy about this one. I am so pumped to show you the next one. Now, when I checked online today, they no longer had this bag on the website. So I did see them this weekend. They were still available on the floor at my Nordstrom. So if anything, you can go in person and see if they have them. But I do think that these sold out pretty quickly. I think a lot of people were eyeing this bag. So this is the top handle bag from Coach. I got the coated leather with the monogram on it. I think the monogram is really, really Really cute. I love the nude shade. It's going to go with so much and it kind of looks very professional. So Coach used to have this bag called the Cassie bag and it was a bestseller. It was limited edition and they no longer sold it for the longest time. And then they recently came back out with the Cassie bag. Now this is a version of the Cassie bag. It's a bit bigger and the top handle is a bit different. You can get the Cassie bag on the Coach website. But anyways, like this is the Cassie bag. It's just a slightly different version. And I've always wanted a Cassie bag and I was excited to see this on the anniversary sale. They did not take the security tag off. My goodness, look at this. The security tag was not taken off. So I'm gonna have to go to Nordstrom and get the security tag taken off. That is great. Happens to the best of us, but that's slightly annoying. Anyways, okay. You know what? When we left JCPenney, the alarm went off and we did not know why. It's because of this bag. That makes sense. Now I know why the alarm went off. Ay -ay -ay. I love a good top handle bag. Now this one holds a little bit of weight, you guys. It's a little bit more professional brief casey than I was expecting than what I saw online, but I just love the nude color so much. And it also comes with a removable leather strap. It's a little bit long, I'll show you. Again, I'll probably switch the strap out because this one I can see myself wearing more so crossbody. So it has the same kind of lock opening and then on the back there is a little pocket right here. And then let's open it up. I gotta take the paper out really quickly. And then here is what the inside looks like. There's two major compartments here and then there's a pocket in the largest compartment. And then we have a zip pocket right here. And then in the front compartment, there isn't any pockets or anything. Oh, there's actually three. There's a back one right here too. So lots of ways to stay organized with this one. Since I can't find this one with the measurements online in any color, here's Here's how it compares to the crossbody I got. It honestly is much bigger than I thought it was going to be. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this on my body. So here is it crossbody with the leather strap on the shortest setting. I don't mind this. And again, like I said, it's like a cute, casual, briefcase-y kind of look to it. I wish the top handle had a little bit of a bigger drop because it is really, really tight. That's definitely a con that I have with this, but I think it's really cute and boxy. And I think imagine this with a gold chain as well instead of the leather strap would be really cute also so I'm very very happy with this I love the color I don't have a bag that is this color so that was another pro to me wanting to pick this bag. So those are the two bags that I decided to pick up. You guys know about my handbag obsession. And since the beauty exclusives didn't really speak to me this year, I took it upon myself to grow my coach collection. Now, as what I believe to be a vetted Nordstrom anniversary sale shopper, I can tell you a lot of the things are repetition from the previous years. So it's probably going to be more fun for you if you are a new shopper. And these are kind of my top picks. In terms of beauty right now, I did post a TikTok of the best and worst at the sale. What I would recommend you towards if you're new to the beauty sets, the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk lip set I think is a great deal if you don't own anything from Pillow Talk because you get the lip liner in two different lip formulations full size for a good price. The deluxe brow kit from ABH is also really nice. You know how we run through our eyebrow pencils like water. I really love the clear eyebrow gel. And this one I almost picked up but I decided I didn't need it. It's the new face starter kit. So it's that new face device that's supposed to sculpt the cheeks and I just thought it was a really really good deal. My new lash which is the eyelash enhancing serum that I use that really works. I have lots of backups but if I didn't have all the backups that I have I would have gotten this because I get this every year. And then I am going to order the Velispa candle set. I really like a boutique candle and every year I buy the Velispa sets because I think they're really good deals and I like getting a variety of scents. Now in terms of the handbags 
section. Of course, I love the two coach bags that I got, and I noticed the base items were not on the website anymore, but definitely check your local Nordstrom because they had them at my local Nordstrom, the base backpack. So in the base items, at least the ones that I'm looking at, are the ones in the Sakura and the Matcha or Pistachio color. I can't remember which ones, but they have the backpack still available on the website. But in stores, they should have the Weekender bag. I'm actually really upset because I think they were on sale for, what, $60? And I actually bought my mom this Weekender bag in black for $100 recently for her birthday. I wish the sale was just a wee bit earlier so I could have saved and gotten it in a prettier color. There's a compartment at the bottom, which is really cool. You can put your shoes and stuff in there. So that's a great travel bag and if you can get them in those colors really cute they also had the base suitcases in the anniversary sale as well so handbags those are mostly what I was looking at and I thought were cute make sure you also check out the jewelry section you can get some really nice quality jewelry at a great discount a lot of $30 pieces as well Kendra Scott I thought this pendant necklace looked so beautiful Madewell also had a three-piece necklace set that looked really Really gorgeous these chain drop earrings I thought looked super unique and then the stone charm collar also looked really cute but there's a ton of adorable jewelry around the $30 price point that Nordstrom has on sale that I think is really nice to pick up if you're a jewelry person home there's only two items I'm not a big home shopper from Nordstrom but they have this marble lazy Susan on sale I bought this last year. I'm excited to see it in the sale again this year. It is heavy duty. It weighs a lot. It is so gorgeous. I do product shots on it sometimes. Highly recommend that. And then also hydro flasks, which are really trendy. I'm a big water bottle person, so that looks nice. In terms of women's shoes, these Adidas shoes. Okay, so I bought these a couple years ago during the Nordstrom anniversary sale. They're still here, I'm telling you. Nordstrom just has like certain items reserved for the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I love these sneakers, they are so cute. I always get compliments on them and they're really comfy. Adidas is my go-to brand when it comes to sneakers. So love that. And then for clothing, I think now is a really great time to buy some nice quality jeans. I saw these Levi jeans, which are really trendy and cute, and I thought a really good price for Levi's. And then the in the athletic wear, I also really like Zella leggings. There are a ton of things that I could recommend to you. Keep in mind, a lot of this stuff is repetitive. Most of the stuff that I'm mentioning are stuff that I already have in love. So I wanted to make sure that you guys knew about it. So let me know your thoughts on this year's anniversary sale. Are you excited about it? Are you yawning about it? It's coming to a close. It should be at this point open to everybody to shop, even if you don't have a Nordstrom card. So for me, every year the sale gets a little less and less exciting, but there's normally some pieces that I want to pick up. Like for example, for me this year, I thought the coach bags looked really cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you found it helpful. Thank you for hanging out. I just wanted to share my new bags with you and then share with you some items that I do think are worth it in other categories because I did do a whole dedicated video to everything on the beauty exclusives page. I will have that linked down below for you if you're interested, but I wanted to branch out into other categories. So yeah, thank you guys so much for liking this video and being subscribed to my channel and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye guys, have a good one. Bye.